Chris, thank you. A car salesman is dead and another man is facing criminal charges after a routine test drive turned deadly. KTLA's Mark Mester is live. Thank you for that. 506 is a time another breakout moment from the Democratic Town Hall. Hillary Clinton was asked about her reaction to Beyonce's controversial Super Bowl performance with some critics believing that it had an anti-police message. Powerful storms are hammering much of the Gulf Coast. And a rare creature has been spotted in Alamitos Bay. And El Nino may be behind the unusual sighting. It's a seahorse. For that, 517 is the time. All right, who's going to be next? Right now, an early morning shout out to Riverside County, Texaco, and Demi Lovato are both hitting the road this summer with different Jonas Brothers. Selena recently announced that uh, the band Dance will be her opening act for her big revival tour, or the DNCE. <laughs> uh, anyway, Joe Jonas is the singer for that well, band. Demi Lovato and Nick Jonas, they're going to be touring together this summer. The suspect was seen on surveillance video. KTLA's Wendy, think? thank you. A man accused of gunning down a one-year-old Compton girl while she was in her crib is due in court today. People Toy were involved. They made their getaway before police arrived. The term natural appears on many food labels these days, from canned food to soft drinks, but health groups New say research may highlight the laziness of today's generation. It appears that millennials, well, they don't like eating cereal because it's too much of a hassle to clean the bowl. Every year, the wireless industry meets in Barcelona. Salona, Spain, for a show called Mobile World Congress. Take care of you with some free cash, and we want to congratulate one of our winners, Wendy Hartledge of San Bernardino. Chris, thank you. A man accused of gunning down a one-year-old Compton girl while she was in her crib is due in court. Apple says it wants the iPhone hack debate to be settled by Congress. The company plans to tell a For more details, let's go to KTLA's Eric. Henry, thank you. 611 is the time still ahead. We're live with newly released surveillance video. Creatures discovered recently along our beaches. Could it be the El Nino phenomenon that's bringing them here? KTLA's Christina Pascucci live in Long Beach. Ginger, thank you. Still ahead, a sexual predator on the loose. Police in Santa Ana are worried a sexual predator may strike again. Officers say he's already attacked three women in recent months. KTLA's Wendy Burke. Victimized by a hit and run scam. The suspect pretends his car has been hit, follows her to an ATM and then gets hundreds of dollars in cash. KTLA's Kimberly Chang has the story. Once again, that was Kimberly Chang reporting. The victim still has to file a report with police, but investigators say they do plan to look into the case and ask anyone with information to come forward. You will soon be able to unlock and start your Volvo with no with your smartphone. No key is actually required. Starting. Well, you can make big health gains with just a small amount of weight loss. Researchers at 